true success starts in an attitude and it ends in an action. It comes from belief in oneself and belief in one higher than oneself. However, it comes quickest to the one who combines confidence and determination with energy and enthusiasm. These words hold truth with me because it was when I was eight years old, growing up in the civil rights movement in Selma, Alabama, when my life was changing without me really even knowing it. Growing up from the Georgia Washington projects from a poor family of eight was rough. Growing up in the midst of experiencing and witnessing inequality, injustice, racial discrimination, violence, tears, and death of a people who were fighting for our inalienable rights. This was devastating. There were times when I was not only disobedient, but there were also times when I was scared and fearful for my life. But it was the confidence and the determination that Dr. Martin Luther King had instilled in me as a child that gave me the energy, the enthusiasm, and the encouragement to continue on. I can remember when I was a little girl, eight years old, being in Dr. King's presence, listening to him speak, and watching the way in which he received people, both black and white, and the way in which they received him. His total demeanor sparkled. It was a great spirit that exuberated in the hearts and the souls of all of the people who were there. Even now, as I listen to Dr. King's speeches, I feel a chilling sensation that reminds me over and over again about that movement. I could remember being in the first grade, how Dr. King emphasized to me the importance of education and how important it was for me to study hard and to work hard in order for me to do and be my best. I constantly think of the many times when Dr. King held my little hands, hoping that he would never let them go. And those many times that he would pick me up and kiss me on my cheek to tell me that he'll like to see me when he returned back to Selma. Memories that I'll never forget.